Des, there's going to be no let up in this heavy rain then, is there? I'm afraid not, no, Anne. The first named storm of the season moves in overnight tonight. Now, Met Aaron, which is the Met Office based in Ireland, have named Storm Aidan the first one of the season. It'll be pushing against the deep low pressure system up from the southwest overnight tonight, predominantly bringing heavy rain through the early hours of tomorrow morning, but also some very strong, gusty gale force winds. And it does mean some really horrible conditions across all of the northwest over the next few days. Hot on the heels of Aden is going to be another low pressure system on Sunday. So no let up, further showery rain, some of it heavy and strong winds. But the rain, of course, will be the real problem and the ground is becoming increasingly saturated for our part of the world and the rivers of course getting more small the weather details later on in the program yeah stay in and keep watching tally thanks joe joe the ground in those flooded areas is still clearly saturated what's the forecast for the next few days well, over the next few weeks, there's bound to be more rain, a problem, of course, for the already saturated ground. As you've seen, the clean-up operation has been huge today across parts of the north, places across the region. I'm afraid this weekend the wintry theme continues. We have a warning in place from the Met Office for snow and ice tonight. And we're keeping a close eye on a weather system down to the south of the UK, which could push up from the Midlands during Sunday and bring some more snowfall for parts of Cheshire, Derbyshire and maybe even Greater Manchester. I'll bring you all the details later on in the forecast. Thank you, Jo. Hello, a very good evening to you. Cold this weekend. We're expecting further sleet and snow showers this evening tonight and for some of us again tomorrow. It does mean it'll be very icy out there and as well as that, a widespread frost to come tonight and tomorrow. What a week of weather it's been. Christoph has moved off and away, but we are pulling in some very cold air from the north, so any showers have the potential to turn wintry, both on higher ground and at lower levels as we go into this evening, overnight and again tomorrow. So a dusting of snow for some of us, a few centimetres up on the hills and it'll be icy and frosty across the board tonight with temperatures down to and just below freezing for northwest England and the Isle of Man. So a couple of warnings in place if you have to travel do take care it's not going to be very nice out there tonight or tomorrow morning. Those are tomorrow's sun times, up at 8.11 and setting at 4.35 tomorrow afternoon. A wintry start to the day tomorrow. There will be some accumulations of snow up on higher ground, certainly, and further showers feeding in on that northwesterly through the course of the day. And these will be turning to sleet and snow, both at higher and lower levels. Certainly at Derbyshire, the Peak District will see up to around five centimetres, perhaps, before it reverts back to rain into the afternoon as temperatures climb to around three or four Celsius. A cold Cold night tomorrow night with a widespread frost to start Sunday. And then in the south, certainly across parts of Derbyshire and Cheshire, during Sunday there could be some snow elsewhere, probably just about avoiding it. As we go into the new week, very gradually things turning less cold. Our weather will be moving in from the Atlantic once again, so it becomes more unsettled, perhaps a bit milder. Bye-bye.